What's this range? I don't know, like 600 meters? 700. Okay, we're ready, we're ready, we're ready. Come on. Come on. This is the longest long I've ever seen on a tank. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Today, we are checking out a round that we really don't give too much respect to. Uh, and this, uh, me and Slickby were chatting on Discord, and, and he used have. He used have on me. He said, Fly, you have to try out the HE on the Object 120. And it got me thinking, why would I really want to do that? Because this, this, uh... This HE has less penetration, less explosive mass than our Lord and Savior KV2. Granted, it's easier to aim. 6.86 kilograms of explosive mass, 54. Wait, is that the same? No, 54 millimeter penetration at any range, any angle, anything. It's HE. And then you look at this 49. Why would I want to do this? Why would I want to? Versus KPZs and stuff that we couldn't even penetrate with the or kill in one shot with the KV2. And then it dawned on me. This thing is still 7.7, .7, ladies and gentlemen. Anything we look at with this high explosive is going to die. Well, it depends on how much ammo they have stored. Uh, some tanks uh, will take it out of the bottom of the tank and they're ready. That's beside the point. Anything but a KPZ is going to be almost one shot potential for this Object 120. Just because the KPZ has the Abrams or that kind of style of ammo storage where it's outside of pretty much the fighting compartment. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's go give some love to the HE. Baby! Wow! It's a start to a great video. Welcome to Second Battle of El Alamein, a map that... uh. You don't, you don't play too much anymore. Maybe that video already made an impact. No, no, no. We're not, we're not that, that good. WWW, go! God, don't you dare give me chat spamming. Okay, well, we got a really strange spawn. The spawn's literally probably about 25 meters that way in, uh, okay. We're just gonna push up the gauntlet here. We got a big gun, a big slung, a good reload, and... I know we're gonna have great teammates this battle, so uh, we're gonna be aggressive. Aggressive with the HE. Wow, versus a huge game of Leos. And uh, comrade, look at the great Object 120 am ammo storage. You know, fuck this, man. I'm, it's too early to do this. We're gonna pull back, we're gonna play smart. Oh my, look at this spot! It does nothing really, but it might it might be able to get somebody. You never know. Yeah. I don't know what we should do, fellas. The Leos are running ramp. Oh, Jesus. Oh, sorry. I was literally scratching my nose. Maybe we'll just stay here. That was awesome. Did you see how much explosive stuff was all over that guy? No. Oh, there we go. That's what I wanted. We saw right there, though, that uh, the... Even though we didn't really penetrate him or anything, that was a bad shot. I was just trying to get it to that lower area on the left side. It damaged his gun, and it... If I was him, I would have shot. Because there's an RNG when it's yellow. But maybe it's changed a little bit. Okay, clear, comrade. We're going to go to Alpha. We got some spots over here. Nice object. Little Leo down. Oh... Okay, we can kill these guys, but we gotta hit Cheeks. Hmm. Yeah, no wonder they have some decent control over Alpha. King Tiger. Oh, he's starting to push this way. How do we get to higher ground here? 
right here might do as well. No, 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 no. Oh, no! Bastard! Bastard! Oh! How did I survive that? Those were Arado bombs, and hopefully... Is this his big one incoming? Uh, yes, we survived it! Oh, that was a nice juke right there. Take that, Bjuts! Okay, Mouse just killed one of our friendly 120s. Maybe he thinks that was me. And I bet he actually killed him. Oh, thank goodness. Maybe we'll get him on the climb. Gun up, gun up, gun up, gun up, gun up, gun up. Gun up. Yes. Man, that's going into space. Vidanya. Okay, so air threat's gone. T-54 is going to be bait. Oh, we got some numbers here, fellas. Come on, turret, rotate. It looks a little damaged, actually, yeah. There should be a mouse here. Should be a panther, too. Should be a Sturm Panzer. Just kidding, they're all gone? Why would they leave this area unless they got killed? Wow, they actually did get killed while I was busy dealing with that duck. Welcome to Kursk. This would be an awesome map if we were using our fin stabilized AP. Uh, but we're going to be using only HE this game. So hopefully... Oh my gosh. Look at this guy, KV2, duh. Hopefully uh, our team can uh, kill the guys at far range and then we can clean up and protect Bravo. Not the best gun to snipe with right now. Well, okay, but it is one of the best guns to snipe with. The only problem is we're not using uh, our, our best round. I see a cannon barrel, but I can't make out a tank turret. Okay, trees are going down. Maybe some more visibility. Got something in sight. We're going to try for 2,000 meters. Ooh. 2,100 meters? Maybe 2,000 meters. I don't know. It's kind of hard to tell where it's, it, it splashes so much. No, that that is over. We're gonna we're, we're gonna go down to ooh, we got a big guy right here. I think eighteen hundred. Oh, you should have died right. Oh, I don't know what just happened, but we killed him. We killed him. Eight hundred meters confirmed. Now there is still some, like a Leo or a STB over here. Why did he bail out so quick? Maybe he thought I would have hit him again with AP. Whoa, whoa, Leo, Le Le Leo, 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 low ground. We're going to say this is probably about hey, 1300, 1400 meters. That looked that exactly that's exactly where I wanted to go. A little bit lower. Beautiful. Good hit. Right for that side turret. A little bit higher. Uh, 
Shouldn't it splash down or something? Yes, okay, we'll just we'll just knock the crew out. Anyone who wants to push, we can easily kill him now. Whoa. Yeah, I thought I saw something over here. Got a Yag Tiger stationary. I'm gonna guess fourteen hundred meters. He can't move. And maybe 1,700 meters? No. If I can just splash it down underneath that lower glacis, we're in business. A little bit lower. Yes. That's exactly what I wanted to do right there. We got six rounds left, and we're going to have a Leo who is on an uber flank. I don't know what this range is, and he's moving too quick. It's going to be hard to judge the forward or the uh, lead shot. Ooh, okay. Oh, he's stationary now. Hit me. Nice. Good bounce. Way too high. Oh, and no, you got me. That's, that's pretty darn efficient for uh, HD on Kursk. I'm going to call it right now. We're going to get killed by artillery this game. Versing the Russians. I don't know. We might be able to make make it there on time. We had a good spawn. But with this uh, with this BR, I think they're going to be able to get there in time. Let's just see what happens. <laughs> I got there. Okay, let's repair the gun breach real quick. 12 seconds. The artillery should be, um, should follow suit here. Yep, there we go. Knew it, knew it, knew it, knew it. Okay, good. They are in alpha now. Now, if we can position ourselves so our... Oh, jeez. The KV-2 would have no problem with that. I mean, I guess we'll just shoot the cannon barrel. I thought we would have enough explosive power just to breach his upper... The plate covering the hole on top. King Tiger. He just got nailed. Okay, that works. That works, though. Okay, two Leos down. Side shooting works great with this, but how do we kill Leo from the front? Huh, that T-54 just got nailed by something. Don't remember seeing any gun debris. Oh, Jesus, there, there he is. Beautiful. 
Really satisfying killing these Leos. In cover again. Okay, there's a there, there's a mouse over here. I just heard it fire. No fucking thank you. No! The snow! I thought I would be good. I thought oh, I thought I would be good. Let's extinguish. We might have some help. Oh gosh, we were so, so dumb. That is the object 120's biggest fear. Anti-air. That was a good choke. That was a <coughs> good joke right there. Screw you! It was this. It was this little piece of debris that ruined it all right there. That is going to be a GG. I just want to go back to the hangar, and uh, well, we gotta stay in this game because we'll get a crew lock. And I want to see how much more effective that one kilogram more of exp it should be. Really, much more effective. So this is the test drive. Here is a up armored Leo. Uh, this is the 8.71. We'll shoot to where we shot the uh, Leo with the object one two zero. Ah, oh, see why why couldn't it do that? Okay, now I actually I just found a proper Leo. So this one has less turret armor and such. Yeah, it it doesn't splash down. Which is uh, pretty incredible. Once the KV 2s enters, it it does all the damage. A little bit low on the shot, but still it got through. Let's try to like maybe shot trap it. Yeah, it does not want to go through the upper, well, the top of the hole. So the KV 2 still reigns supreme as the one shot derp shot machine, but the object one two zero is clearly more efficient for its velocity of the HE round and the reload rate of the HE round. I'm just kind of surprised that this 5.9 kilogram mass can't get through the top of the Leo's top armor. 49 millimeters of penetration. Maybe it's the extra 0.9 explosive filler that the KV-2 has. Or 0.96, excuse me. Because this is the Leo right here. Its top armor is only 30 millimeters. It should be able to get through. Or maybe it has to make direct contact with it. Maybe something I don't fully understand. But let me know in the comments below. Guys, hope you have enjoyed today's video. Have a great day. I am streaming today. Follow the Twitter for more information and bad memes. Guys, have a great day. Peace out.